that clutch defuse at the end and his rifle rifle play has been so good for RBC so far. Got those few opening frags for for RBC. There you go. With that rifle, uh, with that scope sniper rifle, as you said, then he switched over to the shotgun, played defense inside the spawn point. Gone the down every time to enter. Whenever he got shot a few times, he was long how he said, well, I'm just going to run out to the metal now, try and get a few frags while I can. I already did my job. And he got even more than a few. He finished with something like nine frags. Take out Ben. No, he's not. He will take out one. Makolo will come around the corner. He has a rifle. Takes out one, takes out two. Ben, the last one standing. He has 16, 16 health. And the bomb is down, though. 30, 30 seconds and counting. And where is Kola? Kola on 107. So uh, he's on max health. He comes in. He's going to go straight he's for the defuse. defuse. He's going to go straight for the defuse because he knows Ben is too far away. Will he be able to make it? Ben is he's, he's legging it all the way to the bomb side. He doesn't know whether it was a fake or not. But he doesn't know that it was a real defuse. Kola is going to get the defuse. Is he? No, he goes for the fake. He thought that Ben is jumping around. This could be one heck of a play. Will RP, uh, will NFC be able to do it? He no! gets it! He gets the defuse. He gets the defuse. Somehow he gets it. And, uh... My goodness! They get the ninja defuse. Fernando was trying to bait out that the few trying to bait it out and run down and stop him while he's going for the defuse. He thought he had more than enough time to stop him, but was not able to close out. That's tied up for one for one now. Now he smartly switched over to a rifle and said, "I like this choice coming out." Bob as well, he was using the AK-47 for a while, but I don't think that was a smart choice. This is a nice rush coming in from RBC. They get the bomb plant down on A, I believe. Now they're going to try to protect this site. They need to leave the actual bomb site because it's such an enclosed area. We've seen Rex before. He was almost in a duel out there, but no, it's now going to be Cola one-on-one with Fredo. Fredo's going to turn the corner here. Cola has to be really careful with his opening shot. Fredo's going to turn, does not spot Cola. Where has he gone to? He's actually rotated uh, around. Let's see if he can do anything. Cola, he's hiding inside. Yes, so he smart. gets it. So RBC smart. Cola and manages to pick up that round, the first round for RBG. The scope weapon. See if he can make any other implant. He's gonna go for the A plant here in the museum area. Let's see what Snow can do. He's on 20 hit points. He does get gunned down by Cola. Or as I say, he hasn't impressed me with this couple. Now Snow is now coming from the same angle, I believe. If Cola's doing it, he will be able to get it. No, misses the first shot. Snow is now against the kill on the Rex, the claymaker. You're done. It is gonna be Cola gunning down him with a headshot. Stop and Snow is stopped in his tracks. Against that Snow weapon is such a long card. He's gonna try it locked anyway. Doesn't manage to clip it, but it's gonna be the headshot coming in from Calder. Stopping, stop his mouth once again. Oh, yeah. Jumping nicely through the bomb site. 18 seconds left. It's now or never. Verna has to go. He has three points of health. He has to take that cola here. He has to get this shot. Will he get it? He will not. And Cola will get the clutch round for him. Look at how much more effectiveness Cola is for RBC with that rifle out instead of the scope weapon.